Metal Jack. How you doing today? Hey, how y'all doing? It's a great day in Las Vegas. Uh, this is my buddy Jack. He is the world's only miniature pit bull and barking cat sort of thing. We're just getting kind of started here. Uh, looking around for breakfast. What? Are you happy? Are you happy, dog? You want to go chase your cats? Go lick them. You got to go supervise your cats, right? All right. Go on. Go on, sort of thing. Well, it seems like we're getting a few responses off of this video blog. Some folks think that it's uh, important stuff to talk about, and uh, so I guess we'll continue to do it for a while, sort of thing. Um, the thing I want to talk about today is I'm getting a lot of inboxes about uh, this whole thing, about actually two things. One is the fight list. The second thing is about uh, this whole uh, thing about the war effort. Let's talk about the fight list, for instance. In the last couple of days, uh, Zynga has released a new event called that. It's an icing event. Uh, the thing of it is, is that the fight list is not working properly. So you're going to be wind up fighting five and ten people at a time. And people that are five and ten levels higher than you are. Ices are going to be very hard to get. I suggest using Brawler or OGP and just go ahead and let it run. And whatever happens, happens sort of thing. It's only one or two items. They're nifty collection item. It's pretty good stats in that item. But again, when we go back to this number of 501, in order to make a real difference in your stats, you're going to need at least 100, preferably 501 of them. You know, so don't get tripped out. Uh, I think the thing that you should be getting angry about is the fact that my other fight list is screwed up. Because Zynga doesn't do its basics. Uh, my friend Lester posted something to my wall about uh, Shockwave, a flash interface, which is kind of an interesting thing. And I really didn't know what that was until I went and Googled it. And the thing that really amazes me is it's so much closer to video because you have to storyboard it. And that flash is very much dependent on one element on the other. A plus B equals C. It's a basic algebra, algebra formula. If you change the value of B, it affects the whole formula. Zynga obviously doesn't know that. They don't understand that. They really don't give a shit. So when they came up with this icing event, obviously it really affected the fight list sort of thing. So that's the reason why fight list is running slow. You're, and you're fighting five and ten people, five and ten levels uh, higher than you, five and ten times bigger than you are. The other thing I wanted to talk about this morning was I want to talk about this other thing that Zynga decided to update, and that was a whole war feature where they have these achievements, sort of thing. Um, folks are complaining they're getting hit three and four times while they're offline, you know, sort of thing. Uh, people keep coming back and declaring war on them and everything else. Um, <clears throat> which I find would be really amazing because you only declare war once every eight hours. It's not a big thing. Again, you know, it's not like they're coming to rob your property. It's not like they're preventing you from playing the game. If you lose a war, you lose a war. It's not a big deal. You know, it doesn't really interfere with your ability to play sort of thing. Now, if you have a crew of uh, like 50 or 10 or 20 people declaring on war on you at the same time, and they keep coming back, that is because of the fact that that's the way Zynga set it up. There's not a whole hell of a lot we can do about that, except, you know, uh, go get the Ned Kelly mob and go make an example of the uh, guy who's doing it the most, sort of thing. Inbox and tell him, hey, you know, this is ridiculous. But the main motivation why people are doing that is you're trying to get the achievement, you know, which is ridiculous achievement. It doesn't really do anything for you. You know, it's just for bragging rights. But, you know, just keep rolling, rolling along with that sort of thing. Um, if, you know, hopefully you're part of a large crew or a fairly solid crew like LDOP. Um, if you're not, then you're in a lot of problems. The main thing that you need to pay attention with the war function is that you need to look at your top mafia and to promote the guys that are going to give you that 15% bonus or whatever the max bonus is on a particular slot. You need the biggest guys you can there, then you'll stop losing wars. 
You also need to make sure that you have 501 Mafia War members because folks are deliberately targeting people with less than uh, 501 Mafia War members because they want to make sure that they win the war so that they go ahead and get that achievement sort of thing. So those are a couple of really quick things uh, that I wanted to respond to today. Um, on the TGIF front, we just finished up a contest called My Hometown where for simply uh, telling us where you live at and sharing a link about why you live where you do and one of the nifty things about your hometown you entered into a contest where we gave away you know a lot of loot a lot of italy high-end loot and uh some mission loot sort of thing and we're going to be doing more and more of those things um my final thoughts for today is it is really crucially important because of the social interaction nature of this game to be part of a family. The reason that you join a family is for mutual aid and mutual protection sort of thing. Uh, especially with these new missions coming up that you need eight Brazil crew members, you need 20 mission crew members, you need always need upgrade parts sort of thing. Um, so you, there's a whole social interaction of mutual aid that goes on there. You should be able to be part of a family that is going to actually help you. It's going to click your links. It's going to come, come and join your crews and things like that. And on the flip side of the coin, you should be able to do that for them too. Um, it's a quid pro quo cool sort of thing. I think the the biggest reason why you want to join a family is for this whole idea of mutual self protection. There are some really, really mean people out there. There are stalkers, child rapists, just all kinds of just evil, evil, mean people out there. And they're gonna they're coming to hunt you period end it that's all that they do that's their that's how they get their jollies in playing mafia wars it's not accomplishing goals or you know some of the things that most of us do within mafia wars their whole thing is to stalk you and there are people out there that deliberately stalk women so you want to become part of a family like ld op you want to make sure that or tgif you know sort of thing we're a pretty nifty crew also um, you want to make sure that you have added people uh, within the Ed in Ned Kelly mob so that you know, for instance, that you can inbox me or let us know by coming to the Avengers page that, hey, I got a problem, come and help me defend myself. And then what we will also do is we will help uh, teach you how you can uh, defend yourself so that you're not always bothering us. Now, it's not that we don't like to hear from you, but we get a lot of requests. And if we can lessen those requests by one or two, then, you know, that just makes our job that much easier. Plus, it's a lot of fun for us to take a level 200 person within 10 or 20 levels, have them killing people that at levels 5 and 6 and 700. And that's actually what we do, sort of thing. So it's crucially important that you consider, you know, joining either LDOP, which is a really good crew. It's a really good fighting crew with a lot of solid guys there, sort of thing. Uh... A lot of solid, really solid girls there. Um, you want us to consider, you know, hooking up with TGIF. You know, we do some really solid things, um, sort of thing. Um, the last announcement I want to make is that the Mafia Wars Academy is open. There is open enrollment for Mafia Wars Academy. If you are just starting out in the game or less than uh, level, I think, 200, 200 to 400 sort of thing, uh, if you're just interested in more information or making sure that you're right, Please request to uh, to join the Mafia Wars Academy, and we'll definitely include you there. There are several different modules within that academy. Once you get enrolled, we'll explain those modules to you. Let's see, is there anything else? No, I think that's going to do it for today. Uh, take care. I'll speak with you soon. Remember, family first and always, confusion to our enemies.